Ambassador Walcott, I, I would like to discuss your work as a commissioner on the U.S. Commission on International Religious Freedom. New Hampshire is home to an uh, Indonesian community that has come to the United States fleeing religious persecution. The 2017 International Religious Freedom Report details continued violations of freedom of religion throughout Indonesia and lists the country as tier two in its designations. Can you detail some of the instances that led the commission to um, rank Indonesia in the way that you did as not a welcoming country for Christians and other religious minorities? Uh, thank you, Senator Shaheen. Um, yes, the, the trend is not good in Indonesia, and and that is really um, a big part of it, is they're, they're discriminatory against minorities, uh, minority religions, and Christians. They have blasphemy laws on the books um, that are extremely unfair and, and frankly, like every country that has them, they should, they should get rid of them. And can you explain for everybody what those blasphemy laws are? Uh, thank you. Uh, blasphemy laws basically are laws on, uh, in many countries that say uh, somebody can accuse another person of blaspheming the prophet for instance, and um, they are arrested and often um, in jail and sometimes even on death row for that. Um, so they're uh, extremely uh, egregious laws, really. And for Christians or religious minorities that might have to go to Indonesia, are you did the commission find that there is some reason to believe that they might be in danger because of what's happening in the country there? Um, Senator, I am not sure that we determined that precisely. I know that we are very concerned about the situation there uh, for minorities and Christians. Um, whether or not, I don't, well, I don't recall discussing specifically if, if, if Christians went back, if that was considered um, a specific threat, but I would have sympathy for folks that were concerned about that. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Chairman.